imagine Falbrick would be... Fancier. Stocked with better booze. Cheaper. I've emptied 14-bit carts in the last two hours. That's because you've got a terrible tell. Whenever you're lying, your right eye twitches like mad. It most certainly does not. If you're feeling like the civilized type, the waterfall is a good spot to wash your clothes. Keep my head down. Incoming! survive and the weak perish. You seen Arthur today? Did you find them? Tell me you found my dr I mean my sprat carriers. Would hate should anything dire have befallen them. <laughs> Just tell me straight and don't hold back. I can handle it. Sprat can always be replaced. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, this is per... This is only half! Are you... You think you can steal from me? Ow! Damn 
it. That hurt like the blazes. Okay, okay. All right. You didn't take it. But someone did. Search Fallbrook. Either half the Sprats got loose on their own, or there'll be some evidence pointing to the soon-to-be-dead snake who filched my carriers. You want your cut? You get me the rest of my drugs. No matter what it takes. and get your twitchy whiskers back here. Don't you run out that door. It's a cruel world outside. Close the damn door. And you'll let my sprats out. I'll make my way there. Damn it all. Now look what you've done. It'll take me ages to round him up again. State your purpose, or get out of my face, domicile intruder. Missing? Nope. Nope. Mine are all found and accounted for. Thank you kindly. Now if that'll be all, I've got an animal rescue service to oversee, and it ain't easy. Lots to do. Got a multitude of sprats to spay and feed. Day in, day out, they ran their little route, getting picked off along the way. What was I to do, turn a blind eye? Malin's an animal lover. She won't hold my actions against me. Look, I don't care if Nelson sent you or not. You won't be hurting a hair on any of these sprats heads. I've killed vicious beasts for them. I ain't afraid to take on a human. Back out of this domicile, hands up, or become sprat food, intruder. You want to dig through sprat droppings? Be my guest. Get your drugs, then get lost. Leave me and my fur babies be. I think you've given them enough anxiety for one day. They're trembling. Got the goods? Because I know you wouldn't be wasting my time otherwise. Wink. You do? I mean, you do! Of course you do! What did I tell you? Sure, fire, delivery, system. Works almost every time. Right, right. In my excitement, I very nearly forgot. <laughs> ha ha. As promised, you're cut. Plus a little extra to show my gratitude. Now, if there's nothing else you need from me, I must go inventory my goods.
What do you want? Oh, hey, Vicar Max. What are you doing on Monarch? I thought scientists ain't welcome here. Haven't you heard? Everyone's welcome here. It's a fucking worker's paradise. But you wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Never worked a day in your miserable life. You're just a parasite, living off my goodwill. Well, guess what? My goodwill's exhausted, along with my temper. This is the guy who told me about the book while we were in prison. I lied about finding a scholar. But I don't care about any of that anymore. I just want to inflict massive amounts of pain on this guy. Yes, that's about the long and short of it. Now, where were we? Oh, that's right. I was about to beat you. Severely. Wait, wait, wait! I know who can translate the book for you! It's too late for that. I threw away my life chasing fairy tales. Will punishing you fix any of that? Of course not. But by law, it will make me feel a whole lot better. Okay, okay. Talk, Reggie. It was stolen from some sort of expert on philosophism. Weird hermit lady on Scylla. My father used to deliver supplies to the mining outpost there. I don't think so. A crazed hermit on Scylla? He's playing us for fools. It's true. My father collected some extra bits on the side by diverting some of the supplies to the gal. The way he told it, he thought the book looked valuable, so he took it. Couldn't find any buyers when it turned out to not only be French, but banned as well. Fine. We've got more important things to do anyway. Hey, I just want to thank you for saving my life. Exaggeration? Has the vicar told you what he did to old Lem? He's still eating through a tube last I heard. Look, what I may or may not have done to some degenerate during a prison brawl is old news. I'd rather not discuss it. Are you free to talk? I want to thank you for talking some sense into me back there with Cheney. It has been a long time since I gave in to my... violent enthusiasm. You're right. I owe you an apology. I've been so obsessed for so long, I couldn't see anything else. You offered me a place on your crew, friendship, and I used you to get to Cheney. And even then, you saved me from myself. I don't know if I could live with myself had I gone through with it. You owe me nothing, I know, but I... I'm begging your forgiveness. Thank you. I promise I'll be nothing but truthful from this point forward. Oh, exactly as you'd imagine. Can't say I enjoyed this stint. It did provide me with plenty of time to think. The way I see it, the universe was snapping me back to where I needed to be. You stray too far from the course of your destiny. The world will try to correct for it. Hey, 
guess. Knock, knock. I'd turn back. This path has been a death trap for many. Safer paths up can be found to the west. Like you in the name of the law. Look northwest. That ain't it, but marauders sometimes camp inside the buildings there. Steer clear unless you fancy getting shot. Westbound still. I'll let you know when we can start ascending. Have mercy on you. I won't.
make it look so easy. Watch it. His pools don't just stink. They'll take a toe off. If I fall in, you'll pull me out, right? Welcome back. You find anything out there? Let's see. These are old. Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Some bits here, some there, some... Wait. This... This one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it. Just like the one I found earlier. And here's... A letter. Wait, this is from Graham. All the captain. He gave them the gate codes. Yeah. He did. They really did. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? Thank you for bringing this back, but I need some time. I gotta think. I'll let you know if I figure something out. Go take a walk, Captain. I'll find you once my head's on straight. 